Greetings folks, this is a quick update to my previous video regarding uh, automatic readout of a value of some sort, a pot or uh, whatever. A viewer called Brace Sport pointed out that there's a better way to get the readout to work so that it only tells you the, the final position of the pot. And that is, uh, let's go into it, special function, if we play value when the logical switch goes off, that's the exclamation mark L01 there, then uh, we only get the final position of the pot. And if you turn the pot slowly, you'll actually get a, a running commentary of positions. Uh, now, FC told me he wanted it to go from 0 to 100, so you can do that using the custom curve like I showed in the previous video, but you can also uh, forget about the curve if the curve is a bit too complicated and just use weight and offset. Uh, so instead of just having 100% weight, change the weight to 50, change the offset to 50, and that's the same as having a custom curve going from 0 to 100. So let's go through that again. Logical Set up logical switch uh, so that the absolute change greater than or equal to x, x equals 1 is the way I've got it, s2 pot is the uh, first variable, and now I've got uh, a duration of 0 0.05. That just means that the switch stays on for half a second, uh, to give you time to move the pot and um, and stop, basically. You can play with uh, durations and delays to see what works with the way you use the pot, of course, but, uh, but a duration of 0.5 seconds works for me. So set up the logical switch like that. And then special function, Choose uh, not logical switch one. That's mean that means when logical switch one turns off, exclamation mark, logical switch one, play value of channel nine just once. Zero, twenty-two, forty-nine, seventy-six, one hundred. And that works very nicely. Thanks for watching.